I'm Shelly with AA Callister in Salt Lake City, Utah. Today we want to talk about getting a winter blanket for your horse. A lot of riders like to put a blanket on their horse in the winter so they can continue riding and competing through the cold winter months. A blanket on your horse in the winter helps reduce the amount of hair they will put on and thus aid in the cool down process after a hard ride because you don't want your horse to get sick. Other horses that might benefit from a winter blanket are horses that have a compromised immune system or maybe older horses. When getting a winter blanket for your horse, the first thing we're going to need to do is get the proper size. In order to do that, you need to take a piece of rope or twine or a fabric measuring tape, put that at the center of his chest, go around the widest part of his shoulder, the widest part of his barrel, widest part of his hip, and back to the center of his tail. We'll then take this rope or twine and use it up against a measuring tape to get an inch increment he actually measures out to a 78. So that is how to get the correct blanket size for your horse. So now that we've figured out what size blanket our horse wears, we need to talk about the three elements of the blanket. The three elements of a blanket are the liner, which is what goes next to the horse, the fill, which is the warmth of the blanket, and the outer layer or the denier. So let's talk about the liners of a blanket. The most popular liner seems to be the nylon liner just because it keeps the horse's coat polished and soft when it's rubbing against the horse. It just kind of creates almost a brushing effect. So a lot of people like the nylon liner. There are also fleece and felt liners. So it's just a matter of preference. That is something for you to choose on your own. So the next layer we want to talk about is the fill layer and that will be listed as grams. So 100 grams and less is considered a light fill. And if it has no fill, it will just say zero. That'll be a sheet. Then if it's about 100 to 250, that's considered a medium weight fill. 250 and above approximately is considered heavyweight fills. Those are gonna be your warmest blankets. When you're considering the warmth of the blanket, you wanna think about things like, is your horse turned out where there's no shelter? What is the, the temperature variance in your area? If you live in Wisconsin, that's going to be a lot different than if you live in Arizona. Also, you'll want to think about if your horse has been body clipped or if your horse has any age or illness issues. The third layer of the blanket we need to discuss is the outer layer, and that will be listed as a denier number. The higher the denier number, the stronger this fabric is going to be. Some horses can get by with a 600 denier number. That's a horse that's probably not going to chew on his blanket or pull on it. He won't be turned out with other horses that can try to bite or pull his blanket off. Usually about a 1200 denier is kind of standard for most winter blankets. That holds up pretty good to most horses and most circumstances. But then there are the horses that need like a 2100 denier, which is this blanket we have here. That might be for a horse that wants to eat his blanket or he has stable mates that he's turned out with that want to eat his blanket as well. So that's something you want to consider when purchasing your winter blanket. Now that we know the size and the parts of the blanket, let's talk about the two types of blankets that are usually available in the winter. First, we're going to talk about a stable blanket. That's kind of just like what the name implies, that it's meant to be used inside in the barn. The reason is, is because this blanket is neither waterproof nor water resistant. So it wouldn't be safe to turn your horse out for extended periods of time, just in case it got wet. The moisture would go into the blanket and actually ends up making your horse colder than if it has no blanket at all. So just think about a stable blanket it needs to be used in the stable. Pretty simple. Usually your stable blankets, sometimes they have a quilted pattern to them. And also an easy way to find out is this back seam that runs down the center here, which only a stable blanket would have. Another kind of blanket is a turnout blanket, and that's just like what the name implies. It's for your horse to be turned outside into, so this blanket is going to be waterproof. You won't see a back seam on this blanket. They usually will have shoulder gussets in the front so that the horse can run around and play and kick and have fun. Now a turnout blanket is probably the most popular blanket right now for a winter wear, just because a turnout blanket can be used for a horse that's in a stall, but usually a horse that's in a stall can't have his stable blanket outside. So this one is a little more versatile, it can go both ways. Another thing to consider when purchasing your winter horse blanket is the features and benefits that have been put into that blanket. 
it's kind of like buying a new car. The more features that are added to that car, the more expensive the car becomes. And it's the same with the winter blankets. The more additions they make to that blanket, then the price goes up just a little bit. So one thing that you might see is a tail flap in the back. And the size will vary depending on the price of the blanket and the company that makes it. Sometimes the flaps are permanently sewed in and sometimes they are removable. Another feature that you might find are removable leg straps that attach inside the blanket just to help keep it secure onto the horse. Another feature that changes is the straps on the stomach. You might have one or two or a belly band. In the front, we have buckle systems, Velcro systems, a combination of both, or even a closed front blanket. And then this blanket has another additional nice feature, which is a neck cover. That aids in keeping the horse warm and dry. One last thing to consider when purchasing your winter horse blanket is your type of horse. Is he a stocky quarter horse or an athletic Arabian? Here at AA Callister, we carry a variety of manufacturers like Amigo, Big D, and Weatherbeater, just to name a few. We'll help you find the perfect fit for your friend this winter. Give us a call. 